we're just going to give it a few good like that is gonzo look at that oh my god Yo, what is going on YouTube? It is Willie Weasel here, and today we got this ugly, dirty, clapped out 2001 RM125. Uh, today we're supposed to be packing the exhaust on this, uh, as you can tell, the slip-on is off of it. Right over here in this big pile of junky mess we got here, got the, uh, you know, the Pro Circuit, and it literally has, like, no exhaust packing in it, and if it does, I'm assuming the center of it is coated with, like, oil, because it's been running really rich which makes it basically sound like a hollow can. So we're gonna take some of this, you know, exhaust pack in here, roll it up in here really tight like so, and then pack this baby really tight. Hopefully it sounds good and uh, gives it a little bit more power because when the exhaust is not packed, like the, you know, the smoke and sound, everything just goes straight out and it's not supposed to do that. It's supposed to kind of dissipate and quieten down in here, not allow as much emissions, which was which what the bike is meant to run like. And if it doesn't run like that and you don't have it jetted like that, it's gonna run like crap. So uh, yeah, we gotta get into this and start packing this exhaust here. I don't really, all right, I don't really wanna bend this mount or dent it much more than I already have. If you can't tell, it just flattened off right here. So I'm gonna take this rag, wrap it around right here like this. And then give where uh, give me somewhere to smack onto with my little pecker here, and hopefully we can you know knock this out. So we we'll have to hold onto it like this, and then hit it right here, but with this obviously wrapped around that like so. So I'm gonna give that a shot. So we got it wrapped up good and tight. We're just gonna give it a few good like knocks like that. It's still probably gonna bend that mount. Yeah, it did it bend it more? What am I supposed to do here? That exhaust is aluminum. This will not slide out just easy. Hold on. I'll be back just a second when I get this loose. A few minutes later. All right, guys, look here. We've got her broke free that much. And honest to God, <laughs> I'm happy about that. Let me show you how I was doing it. Okay, I was hitting this, and it started bending the uh, good old uh, exhaust mount. So I decided we're going to take and put the vice grips around this little... There's like a little clamp here. Looks like somebody welded onto it. Not a clamp, but like a stopper. See that? Looks like it's been welded onto it. So take, you know, the vice grips put on there like so. I readjust them real quick. 12 seconds later. Anyway, take the vice grips, put them on there like so. Oh, don't want to put them on there too tight. Because I don't want to bend the exhaust in. Don't want to mess with the exhaust like circumference at all. But we take it like this, and we beat the shit out of it. Look at that. <laughs> Just like I said. I believe she needs some crank seals, if you ask me. Oh my gosh. Let's see if we can't get that out. Ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> that is gonzo. Look at that. Let's cut her open here. Look at the inside. Oh my God. Have you all ever seen exhaust packing this bad? Look how hard that is. Look. Listen. Just tear it apart. My God. God, that is literally as bad as it could possibly get. No joke. Oh my God. Guys, look at this. Every single hole on this is clogged up. These are supposed to be open. All of these are supposed to be open. Every single one of them. And they're all clogged up. We're going to have to take a wire brush to this and clean this and uh, get it lined out. So I'll see you guys in literally like five or ten minutes for me, but... Just another second for you guys, because, man, this looks rough. Uh, I couldn't find a wire brush, so we're going to burn them out. That's the only way I could think of. Pour a little gas on it, burn them out, let it cool off. It'll be fine. I can see the hose opening it up already, because that's what they are. The Made out of fiberglass. Uh, no, not, not really, not yet. Uh, 12 o'clock midnight. <laughs> well, guys, as you can tell, it is dark. Very dark. That's how long it took to get this son of a gun packed. This was the most stubborn exhaust I've ever had to pack. Well, the only exhaust I've ever had to pack. But, uh, yeah, thanks to J-Rod and his dad over here, we got some uh, good old help, and we finally got it back together, which I don't think I could have done it by myself, no joke. But let's go ahead and slap this on the bike and see what she sounds like. Squeeze by you. Okay, now let's uh, mount up the old exhaust, as I was saying. Get my seat boat and stuff, put it in my pocket. Make the sound test do it. Just, wow. Oh yeah, we gotta see if it's if it's packed better. Hold on, oh, drop my nut. It seems to be packed. All right, guys, we got the exhaust back on there. It is good and packed now, so hopefully, it sounds a lot better. It was sounding like a 
hollow tin can. It's still gonna echo because we are under the carport, but it should not be as bad. Oh. <laughs> before <laughs> what now we might be able to get it to idle but yeah that sounds ooh 10 times better crispy two stroke let's go drop a like on the video if you guys like that well guys and gals i guess we're gonna have to call this an end to the video as you can tell it was getting really dark but if you like this content please be sure to drop a like on the video as it does help out the channel tremendously and if you want to see more content like these clips i'm showing right here please be sure to subscribe to the channel because we are posting content like this really regularly now and uh if you want to see you know some more riding videos on this rm125 after i get the exhaust packed like we did in today's video please be sure to stay tuned to wednesday wednesday we will post the next video and probably friday we're going to post another video on the rm if we don't trade it off but Thank you for watching, and this has been the Willy Weasel. Peace out.